custom hive stat cards are a pretty popular thing going around the hive community right now and a lot of people don't know how to get them so in this video i will be showing you guys how you can make your own hive stat card let's get into it all right so there are actually two different ways you can do this first you're going to need a discord server so to create one scroll down to the bottom of your discord servers tab on the discord app or website press add a server create my own for me and my friends and you can customize it if you want to or just leave it blank and click on create. Once you have your server, go ahead and click the top link in the description below, which will take you to this website. Go ahead and click add assistant, select the server you just created, press continue, keep all of these on, press authorize, confirm you're a human, and there you have it. Now that the bot is in your server, it's super, super simple to create a custom stat card. All you do is slash hive and here's a list of all of the game modes you can do. If you want to do Treasure Wars, you can type in your name. So I'll do Peister11 and then give it a second. And here you go. Here's my Treasure Wars stat card. Uh, I'm not very good. You can do any game with the exception of the bridge. And you can even do Slash Hive Profile. And although it may take a couple minutes, it's pretty cool because it'll give you a profile of all of the games with the exception of the arcade games. They've got your total Hive level, which I have 491 levels on Hive. Sky Wars, Survival Games, Just Build, Treasure Wars, has everything here. I have won 12,332 games on the Hive. That's crazy. If you are tired of typing in your name every single time, you can do slash link, type in your username, and although I've already done it, so it, it should show something different, but it'll connect that gamer tag to your name. So that way, every time you type in a command, you don't have to type in your username. Just do slash Hive, Ground Wars, or whatever the game is, and it'll default it to your username. They've also got a nice little progress bar for your level if you're feeling depressed while trying to level up in a horrible game mode. And uh, yeah, it's that simple. If you're looking for an even easier way of doing that without creating a server and all that stuff, I have the Discord bot added to my server. You can just click on the link down in the description below to join my Discord server and the bot will be there waiting for you. Thanks for watching. Hope I helped you out.